Yeah, what's up, YouTube? It's Tino Fest 1999. I just took a little break right now. I'm back doing another video. It's about Randy Orton being, be, being accused by a 15 year old kid up there in Boston, Massachusetts. Boston, Massachusetts, yeah, that um, the whole thing with Randy Orton, supposedly the 15 year old dude asked him for a damn picture. And all Randy Orton did is walked away, and all of a sudden the kid went up to him, and Randy Orton spit him in the face with a gum. Yes, yes, ladies and gentlemen, people, with a damn gum. Gum. A chewing gum. He spit him right in that kid's face, and now the kid is accusing Randy Orton for doing that to him. I don't know why, what, what, I don't know what's going on with Randy Orton these days, man. But like I said, Randy Orton, he, he, like that guy is a hothead. Why, why he has to treat, why he has to take on a fans like that? For real, seriously. Why, why he's gonna do that to a 15 year old fan like that? You can't do that to a fan. Don't, don't take it on a fan just because he's asking for a picture. I know what, what, what he's going through. There's a lot of things and all that stuff. He's going through a lot of shit. But why, why in the hell Randy Orton will do that stuff? But come on, you gotta give the guy a break, dog. That, that the kid a break, man. Randy Orton should not be spitting on the guy like that, man. Like I said, Randy Orton, you're a third generation superstar, and you doing that to a kid, dude. That makes you look bad, man. Seriously, honestly, from my perspective, it makes Randy Orton looks bad, look bad. I'm telling you right now, cause come on, why are you gonna spit on a kid, a 15 year old kid? He's just asking for an autograph. Now, he's going to go through criminal shit. Now, the, the kid's going to fall for a lawsuit because of Randy Orton spitting him in the face with a gum. Like I said, Randy Orton is a fucking grown man. He's 29 years old. And why the hell he's going to do that stuff? And he was WWE champion. Why he's going to do that to a kid that's looking for controversy? Why? Because he's a heel. He's too far for his gimmick, for his character. Come on. Randy Orton, former WWE champion. Former Air Connell champion and former tag team champion, and Randy Orton goes up to uh, up to that kid spitting him in the face. Come on, Randy. I, I guess you're you're high on drugs. I don't know. I don't know what's going on, with Randy Orton, man. Randy Orton is, is out of it. You know, he's going crazy. He's going crazy for all this shit. You know, Randy Orton. If he did, if he did do it, he's gonna have a price to pay, dude. You know what I'm saying? He's not have a price to pay for just doing stupid things like that to a 15 year old and He's underage still. He's not even 18 yet. If you get if Randy Orton gets look, if Randy Orton gets accused and they file his lawsuit, he got what he deserves. You know what I'm saying? He got what he deserves. Cause Randy Orton has no right to spit. On a fan like that, especially if he's under age, there's no right to do that. It just, it just makes no common sense for Randy Orton to spit that kid in the face like that. Sure, he spits legends in the WWE with Mick Foley and and Harley Race and these guys, but come on, that's a kid, that's a fan that want that looks up to you. Why in the hell Randy Orton does stuff like this? Come on. When I went the other day on SmackDown ECW show. On the hotel, trying to meet CM Punk, a wrestler I liked. I asked him, "Excuse me, Punk, may I have a picture and an autograph with you?" You know what he says to me? Sarcastically, I can't hear you. And you know what? I let I let that guy alone. I I mind his own business. I let that guy go. I don't want to go up to him and he say. I can't hear you. That means he doesn't want to give you a picture or an autograph. I'll, I'll do. I'll walk away. I'll feel the same way. I'll be. Like, I'll be mad at the same time. But come on, you can't take it on fans like that too. You know what I'm saying? Because now, because you're a big star, it makes you think that you're gonna be a big star. You're gonna act like a dick in front of people like that. Nah, man. It's not. That's not how it goes, man. That's not how it goes. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, like I said, man, Randy Orton, if he did this, he got what he deserves. Because I know personally, I don't know Randy Orton as a person, but I, I, I see him in his eyes. 
He's not a good. He's like you could say he's not. He's not a type of person you could be friendly with. I'm telling you that right now. But Randy Orton, if you do that, man, he got. He pretty much got what he deserves, man. If he filed the lawsuit and and the the fifteen on win the case, Randy Orton got what he deserves, man. And Karma's gonna come come back and hunt him for doing that stuff. Can't be doing that, man. As a fifteen year old kid, man, disrespectful. Maybe the kid might have do something, might have do something that told, might might have cursed him out. But probably the kid was just asking for an autograph and a picture. That's it. I don't know what's going on, but all I heard it was the uh, uh, Randy Orton being accused by a fifteen year old kid up there in Boston, Massachusetts. That's all. And now the mom is helping him. He's gonna be on the case. His mom and all that bullshit. So like I said, people, you know, do you think Randy Orton is making? He's making. Is making no sense for doing that to the kid. Tell me, people. Tell me. Send me a comment or a video response. Tell me what's up. What, what's going on with Randy Orton? What is going on? Because really, Randy Orton is becoming like a big star. He's being a big shit on WWE, and you know, makes him look like he's he's a big star. So he could be a dick like that. He's being too cocky and arrogant. Don't take it on a person. Don't take it on a fan, man. I hate that shit. You know what I'm saying? All right, guys, take it easy. I'm gonna do another video of the ECW or re um uh, review and the Monday Night Raw review. So I'm gonna be back with y'all in uh maybe in 20 minutes. All right, guys, take it easy. I'm, I'm gonna be back in a couple minutes later.